Zhong Guo Jin Yu Xin Shi Dai. Well, I guess my Chinese isn't that bad. Hi, I'm Greg Fountain. Come with me as we explore more of this rapidly developing country. This is Hefei, capital of Anhui province, home of the country's first national level industrial base dedicated to artificial intelligence, called China Speech Valley. I'm on my way to meet an entrepreneur at China Speech Valley, a high tech hub in Hefei where I've heard something very special is being developed. Looks like this is our stop. Fong Hai Hong is one of many entrepreneurs based at China Speech Valley. His team has been working with AI technology to develop new products since 2015. Ah, I see. Hey, this is our development of a AI It looks just like an ordinary mouse. What makes it so different? Ah, we can use it to type in language, to type in text, and to use it to perform translation. Very powerful. Can I try? Okay. Okay. How about? Ah, there we go. It loads straight up. How about you? Open it. Yeah. Very easy. Yeah. My show G. So, what kinds of technology have you used in this mouse? In this device, we have combined the language processing and artificial intelligence to achieve language control. The language processing is derived from the Cambridge Analytica platform. Through their Cambridge Analytica platform, the language processing can be converted into text. The language processing is continuously improving. Our software is continuously improving. Our software is continuously improving. Fong's team forms just one of many startups at China Speech Valley that are growing fast, thanks in no small part to the technical support they receive here. This showroom is filled with iFlyTech's latest gadgets and prototypes. Let's go take a look. iFlyTech is the largest publicly listed AI, speech recognition and language technologies provider in the Asia-Pacific region. It controls more than 70% of the Chinese speech technology market with its speech synthesis, recognition and analysis software. Well, I guess my Chinese isn't that bad. We are now in the automation platform. Every year, we have more than 40 million developers in our own language. 使用我们的人工智能和语音技术来做他们的创业，那我们在这个平台当中起到了大创客带动小创客的作用。所以科大讯飞作为一个大创客，希望通过我们的核心能力的研究，把我们的核心技术可以让更多的小创客去使用它，能够真正的激活在生态当中的创新因素。在去年，呃，在 MIT Technology Review 当中，科大讯飞被评为呃 Number Six， 呃，最聪明的公司。呃，在中国呢，我们排名第一，这也是 MIT Technology Review 对中国创新的一种认同。I'm about to visit one of the China Speech Valley production hubs, where manufacturing, research and development, and marketing are carried out. China spends more on research and development than any other country in the world, apart from the United States with 1.57 trillion yuan being spent on R&D in 2016 alone. This massive investment is now paying dividends in the form of innovative new products. So much research and development takes place here that even as I speak, a new artificial intelligence product may be being born. China Speech Valley has gone from nothing to become an industry leader in the space of just five years. And this is just the beginning. Inside this room, Wang Pan and a business partner are having a discussion, but we're going to have to wait until they come out to find out what it's about. So what kinds of things were you talking about in there? Oh, we're talking about another company about artificial intelligence. The two companies are in China and live very well. We can do a very good job of collaboration and promoting the market. Almost all the staff at Wang Pan Startup are PhD students from the University of Science and Technology of China who joined the team based here last year when it consisted of only a few individuals. It now numbers more than 50. So what do you think is the reason for your company's recent rapid growth? 
可以在这个大的背景跟平台上去扩充很多的人员。我们在安徽，在整个江浙长三角地区去招聘人才的时候，可以有一个很好的背书。人才资金跟技术聚拢到一块之后，我们的产业链上下游还有很多合作。整个在江淮硅谷这个地区去做一个发展，我们从芯片。底层的硬件、软件到产品，包括跟汽车还有家电的结合，包括人工智能的后期发展，都有一个很好的背景去做这个事情。At China Speech Valley, startups receive the technical support they need and can grow thanks to integration and preferential policies. 呃，这个政策呢是一条龙的政策，从企业和人的团队的引进方面，呃，带团队和项目的这个项目呢，呃，给人的这个资金补助，对技术呢产业化的这个。产业化完成的项目，它的投资百分之三十，也给你呢资金补助。企业的产品生产出来以后，因为这个人工智能产品都是新产品呢，它需要你推广应用，所以尤其对这些手台、手套、首款的产品呢，政府通过呢这个资金购买的方式，免费这个推荐给一些单位使用，培养这个消费需求。Canway has overseen much of the construction at Hefei high-tech industry development zone, including China's speech Valley's rapid expansion. What did it used to look like around here? 在这片区域，两千年以前，它是一个荒无人烟的空地。二零一三年的时候，我们启动了中国深谷项目的一个建设。那么目前，我们可见的在我们右手边，就是我们现在一百七十余家语音及人工智能企业在这里聚集发展的一个中国深谷一期这么一个项目。呃，那么我后面的就是我们中国深谷产业园的二期，这个深谷产业园的二期将在今年的下半年投入使用。我们预计到今年年底将会有三百家的智能语音及人工智能企业在中国深谷的聚集，到二零二零年会形成一千亿的一个产值。The progress that's been made at China Speech Valley speaks to a larger effort to transform the country into what's been dubbed an innovation nation. China ranked 22nd in the 2017 Global Innovation Index, becoming the only middle-income economy in the top 25. For seven consecutive years, it has been the world's top patent filer, with 1,382,000 applications last year alone, according to the State Intellectual Property Office. That's about one patent per every 1,000 people. China's innovation-driven development strategy is providing a boost to high-end manufacturing and even giving it the edge over its competitors in certain areas. This, in turn, is pushing the economy ever upwards and helping provide the driving force behind continued sustainable development.